So the only thing you need to know about this poem for this first poem is that there is a small boy who has the world in his pockets. And when I talk about this kid, I mean to say that he actually literally does have continents in the contents of his pockets. He has seven seeds spilling out the holes of his blue jeans in his right pocket. There's a box of matches, a rock, a chain. In his left pocket, there's two rubber bands, another rock, a penny. In his back pocket, crushed flowers. In his other back pocket, black cats. And see, the thing about this kid is that this kid lives in a house built of matches, and he sleeps in a single matchbox. This kid, he lives in a house built of shouting matches, and so he escapes into borrowed books. He escapes into arroyos covered in cacti. He says that our dreams, they have to defend themselves. He says that our wishes are born of ashes, and sometimes we just have to be the ones to start the fire. And there's this kid with the world in his pockets. He's the same kid who has windows for eye sockets. He collects thick purple glass from the desert, and he thinks about melting it down to make his mother a gown that she could put on to meet the dawn and let the sun notice her bright. There's a boy who wishes that his mother would marry the sun. He looks up and he thinks it would be fun to meet the men he sees leaping from cloud to cloud because there is another neighborhood atop thunderheads where little boys that build beds of clouds where black cats explode into thunder. This is where he wants to live with his mother. He wishes that the son was his father whose love turns his skin tan instead of the father he does have who turns his skin blue and black in spots and stitches. Right pocket, two dreams meeting each other for the first time. A rock, a wire, left pocket, a pencil, a pad, 15 excuses and not one. Dad, back pocket, balloons, back pocket, black cats, because sometimes life is like that, right? Blue and black when it should be brown. Sometimes life is like that, 15 flowers in a noose. Sometimes life is like that, a father with a mouth full of fists. And there's this boy who has the world in his pockets. He has continents in the contents of his pockets. There's a boy who comes from a house of broken promises. A boy who lives. There's a boy who has the world in his pockets. And he has bruises on his arms. He has black eyes, a house built of black eyes. He says, our wishes, a boy's dreams, who had built a combustion of his dreams. A boy who wishes that his house was more than ashes. A boy who wishes that his dreams were more than ashes. There is a boy with the world in the contents of his pockets, there is a boy who wishes that his dreams wouldn't go up in flames. There is a boy whose house is built of bruises and black eyes. There is a boy who's building another dream, whose wishes are born of the ashes of his father's house. There is a boy who kneels towards his father's house, watching flames feel the walls, watching flames combust his past. There is a boy who has the world in his heart and matches in his hands. He kneels towards the house and he watches his future be born.